This is Jason with MaxAmps.com. This is your how-to video on how to charge and discharge a LiPo pack with the Hyperion EOS 720i AC-DC charger. Uh, to start out with, pick your correct balance adapter board. Uh, we're going to use the blue Hyperion board. Our packs are built with the standard plug as the Hyperion. Take the black JSTXH, a line style board, set that aside, you're not going to need that. Next thing you want to do, plug in your main charge lead, red to red, black to black. Plug in your pack. Uh, today we're going to be dealing with a 3-cell 5250 11.1 volt max amps LiPo pack. So you want to hook up your main leads and plug in your balance taps to the 3S port. Okay, your next step then is to set up a memory position if you haven't already for the specific LiPo pack. We're going to use memory position number one. Again, press enter, your memory position flashes. Use the up and down arrows to select your memory position. Once you've got the memory position you want, press your down arrow, go to battery type, hit enter, make your changes. You want to see LiPo on the screen there. Once that's done flashing, press down again. You're going to want to set up your cell count or pack voltage. We're dealing with a 3 cell 11.1 volt pack, so we need the screen to reflect that. Use the enter button, use the up and down arrows to make your choice. Select 11.1 volt 3S, we've got that. Move to your pack capacity. We've got a 3 cell 5250. The charger goes in 100 milliamp increments. Uh, set your charger to 5300 milliamps. That way you'll ensure that this pack will get fully charged. So once that's done, go to your charge rate. Once you set the pack capacity, the charger automatically sets to a 1C charge rate, so we're already seeing 5.3 amps on the screen. That's done. Hit the enter button and then down again. You're going to see your temperature cutoff. If you're using the external add-on temp sensor, set your temp cutoff to 120 degrees. Press down, move to your safety timer. Safety timer set for 120 minutes. Standard charge time on an empty pack at a 1C charge rate is usually about 80 to 90 minutes fully balanced charge, so 120 is a good safety point. Once that's set, go to your TCS capacity, set it to 100%, fully charged pack. Next setting is your end action, your TCS end action. What you want the pack to be doing when the charge is complete is go into a maintain mode. What the charger will do is not charge it anymore, but it will hold its voltage where it's at until you shut the charger off and end the whole cycle. So leave that at continue. Go down to your TVC, leave that at 4.2 volts. Don't make any changes there, not necessary. You want the pack to fully charge at 4.2 volts per cell, so that's where you want to leave that. Next, go down to discharge. Your discharge rate at this point, we're going to leave it at 5 amps. And you can go down again, and you discharge voltage per cell. Uh, the charger comes stock set at 3.0 volts. Uh, I usually like to bump that up a little bit to 3.2 volts per cell, so we're going to set that there for the cell cutoff. And once that's done, then you go back to your main screen. Everything should reflect the pack that you're dealing with at this point. So now to charge the pack up at this point with the 720i, press and hold enter. You're going to see charge start solo mode come up on your screen. That's where you want to be for a normal charge. Press and hold enter again. Goes into battery check status. Sounds off the alarms. It's asking you if you're dealing with a three cell pack, which is correct. So you hit enter and it starts to charge the pack. Once the charge is complete, the charger will sound off an alarm. At that point, press and hold enter. You shut the charge sequence off. You can then disconnect your pack and go and use it. Okay, that's how you charge a LiPo pack with the Hyperion EOS 720i AC-DC charger. Now we're going to show you how to discharge the same pack. It's really relatively simple at this point. If you need to discharge a pack for any reason, what you want to do is press and hold enter at this point. You come to your charge start screen. It says solo mode. What you want to do at this point then is use your up and down arrows and you want to go to the screen that says discharge start solo mode. Once there, press and hold enter. It goes through the battery check. Cell verification, three cell pack, correct. Hit enter again. 
charger starts the discharge sequence. At that point, the charger is going to start doing its discharge. When the pack reaches the cutoff voltage per cell of 3.2 volts, the charger is going to sound its alarm again. Then, simply press and hold the enter button, shut off the sequence, and disconnect your pack. It's been discharged. That's how you discharge a pack with the Hyperion 720i AC-DC charger. For more information on this charger and others, visit maxamps.com.